right, well, this man has been there before, and he certainly looks like it, the number one middleweight contender back in a championship setting, and we've talked about this a lot, but he made himself undeniable with this run back to contention. Now he tries to rest away the goal. That's not easy, John. It's not easy to make your way back because you have been there before, and maybe it didn't work out for you, but to stay positive, to have that steel trap of a mind that allows for you to rebuild yourself makes you know when you do get back, you have a greater... You ready to fight? Ready. Let's do it. So here we go with the start of round one. Anderson Silva didn't even go to a decision from 2004 to 2009. He has been a fast starter. Most of his UFC fights ending in round one or round two. We'll see how he approaches the early going here. Early connection with the left from the champ. Oh, big elbow. He's got the single collar tie. Staying busy in the clinch lands a nice punch there. Nice body shot. Nice front kick lands for the kickboxer there, and I guess on the other side. Oh, flying knee right to the melt. Shale's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Get that right hand up. Oh, big elbow. Well, his wrestling has been a great equalizer thus far. Oh, and he locks up a triangle that... Looks tight, DC. It's very tight. And now he's just got to start passing the arm across, pulling down on the head and feeding the hip. Oh, wait, he got out! Unbelievable that he was able to survive that triangle attempt. He took slight movements, got off to the right side, got his arm free, and found safety. That was tremendous defense. All right, so look at that. A cut has been opened around that eye area. He's taking shots over and over again to that area, and now he's dealing with a cut. Oh, he needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Silva's trying to get a triangle here. Oh, good technique there. He's got the triangle choke locked in. Oh, there's the top! Goodness. Absolutely remarkable what this fighter was able to accomplish here tonight. As you can see, the years of repetitions in the gym to set it up and ultimately get the tap there. Great technique to set up the finish. All right, let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. Just watch how slowly he approaches the submission, though. He never rushes. He takes his time, but it's his trickiness. It's his ability to trick people into going to the floor with him that puts them in danger and finishing fights. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. 